Here's me. Oh my god, and another oh, little... Oh, shit. There. Yeah, like, uh, yeah, another uh, little treat for you here. Uh, I found one other thing I made as a kid. Um, it's a book that's, like, bound and shit called yeah. Power Blast. We are now going to convert uh, you to the Power Blast Church. Uh, if you heard the good news about the power blast, uh, that's written in power blast. Yeah, yeah, like you'll you'll see it once we start it. It's written in like black pen on a black book, but like this is like a Barnes and Noble it's like journal, like a bound in journal. The world. And uh, here we go. I'll show you kind of what that's all about. Oh boy. I was yeah. so metal when I was a kid. I wrote a black pen on the black book. See, it, you can hardly see it. <laughs> yeah, hardly, yeah, you can. It look. says "Power Blast" by me. Oh shoot! It's like yeah, and it's, it's, it's like way creepier looking in like this like scanned version. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. it looks like evidence. Like, yeah. It's like a little yeah. black book of murders. <laughs> so like, I'll murder that bitch again. I gotta hit that bitch up. Hey, are you are you still alive? Did I finish murdering you? And he's no answer. It's like, oh, okay, I guess I did. <laughs> wow, what an opening graphic. Yeah, so... What I can tell is it's a... There's a zebra tree yeah. that is uh, being <laughs> attacked by a snake. Yeah. Okay. Well, there are thunderclouds <laughs> shooting from a bunch of different directions. Yes. Um, two, of, two of those things are right. Uh, what this is supposed to be is like a tractor beam, oh. and this is supposed to be Heaven's Gate. Oh, oh dude! My God, that's the best state. No, that wasn't stain. Um, Heaven's Door. That was that, was, that of. was the one I was yeah. thinking of. Um, and there's some shit going on down here. It's just you know generic. Mm, yeah, it's it just looked kind of empty without some shit down here. Yeah, yeah so I, just put, <laughs> I just drew something there. <laughs> And then a bunch of lightning clouds, power blast. Do you know what this has to do with the power blast? No. Fuck all. <laughs> yeah, yes. Yeah. There That's is no the power blast. Story. Uh, this is Sperm. technically a character. Oh. It's talked about once. Whoa. Oh. And by talked about once, I mean like mentioned in the table of contents. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> <laughs> this is a thing. Speaking of the table of contents. Oh, oh yeah. Team up. Goodbye. <laughs> what? <laughs> TG stands for team up. Goodbye. <laughs> All right. Good. It's uh, like Power Rangers start. who are really fucking like depressed and don't want to do anything, but they still are Power Rangers, so they're still like enthusiastic. Like, let's all team up. All right. Goodbye. <laughs> so, so chapter on. one, Demon Rage. That's a good name for chapter one. <laughs> Chapter 2, The Power Blast. I guess The Power Blast has something? I don't know what I it guess would this, be. This, this chapter 2 is The Power Blast. Chapter 3, Aura vs. Shade. Dude, it's just like Pokemon. It's Lucario Four, and Dark Dragon Dark. X. 5, Dragonaut. 6, Dude. Love, Dragon love and... War. Marriage. Uh, uh, mage? mage? Magic? <laughs> Propriety. Love and magic, mage. I don't gonna... know. And laser snake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh fuck! That really, that really took went places. I mean, like you know, <laughs> it's just a bunch of nonsense at first, and then just a laser snake. <laughs> like that would have been a great hair band. I imagine it starts with like uh, dragon X. <laughs> no, thank you. More like dragon knot. <laughs> 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 Uh, but like uh, Dragon D's nuts. Okay, but uh, because I actually do know what this and this are, just because I'm me and I made it. Like when I was, this was actually earlier than Ishtaria. Holy <laughs> shit! It's the uh, precursor. To I was eleven when I made this one. Uh, T means is a symbol that's just in the prose. That means that a team up happened. Ah, uh, and a G. Means that a team up ended. Oh, so you just so just like instead of just Be, saying because like you can't infer that from the context. You need like you need that just, just, to say, just like a symbol saying oh yeah they teamed up. All right, all right, that guy went away now. 
This is the and and this no, chapter six is love and marriage, and I did not know how to spell marriage at the time. Oh, you just like scribbled out some letters to kind of spell <laughs> Well, it. you're going to see what it looks like later. Also, this is like, <laughs> it's so full of spelling mistakes, it's like unreal. <laughs> and also, I did not finish this book, obviously. Well, I mean... Like, uh, otherwise, it would have been published yeah. by now. <laughs> Demon rage. Once. Oh, oh, yeah. Um, let me let me explain this first. Um, the first, I was playing Legend of Mana on the PS One. It's like Seiken Denetsu three, I think three or four. Yeah, I, I don't remember which one it is, but yeah. But you're right. But it's like number three, the first two chapters are just the plot of something that happens, even down to, like, what the mission is. Demon <laughs> Rage <laughs> is what it is in, the, it, oh, in Legend of Mana. Shit. Wow, they really ripped you off. <laughs> right? <laughs> How dare they? Once there was a cat-slash-human named Diana and a long-haired man named Eskad. <laughs> that is just verbatim... Legend of Mana, right there. <laughs> Nothing changed. Like, the names are the same. Nothing has even changed. The most powerful Knight. <laughs> Knight. Pat and Knuckles. Pat. Yeah, I am the main character of this book. <laughs> also canon in Legend of Mana, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> technically. Uh, Pat had... Everyone, insert character, is just you. Yep. Everyone's Pat had one more mile to go until he found Diana and Escad. Diana and Escad have always fought and lost to an evil demon named Irwin. Shit. Irwin? Yep, that's, that's the first page just setting up exactly what happens in Legend of Mana. So there's Diana with the... So is this, like, fan fiction then? Well, I mean, it's basically just taking um, the fiction with none of the fan. Not really. <laughs> fan fiction would imply I did anything with it. <laughs> <laughs> straight as wrote down the stuff that was on the, on the day in the game. It's just gotcha. So it's I just a, did it again. It's a it's a it's a <laughs> synopsis. Like, the the, the <laughs> synopsis. What, what's better is like it eventually kind of gets away from that a little bit, but not really. It is more like fan fiction. But look at the. Iskad right there, which does not... Here, let me... Let me just, uh... Open this up here. Diana... Not Danis. Daenerys Targaryen. A uh, legend... Of... Man. Uh, here. So, just... This is what that... What... Dan, it looks like in the game. Oh, that's pretty it has, cool. has like nunchucks and shit. And then there's Eskhead. And he looks like that. Oh, I remember. Yeah, I did play this one. Oh, oh really? I remember that guy. Yeah, I played this one. Yeah. A little bit. And like, there's a point when they like fight each other and you have to pick a side and you kill the other one. Yeah. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't beat this game, but I did play this a little bit. And so, like, I have one mile to go until I get to them. They all, and they, and then, oh yeah, I should also, eh, no, I'll, I'll wait till I get there. <laughs> uh, they told him their story, and I'm like, oh shit, I fucked up. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah I, was told, just, I was like, is that more blood? Like, <laughs> No, no, I didn't bleed on this one. <laughs> they told him their story. He decided to help them. T. Team- team Ooh. Titans, go! Be- because, like, in the game, when you team up with someone, it makes this noise. Oh, yeah. And so that, you... that T is that noise. Oh, is he so... <laughs> <laughs> like... Makes sense. You can uh... even just, just bang. They're in a team now. Like you just, just in parentheses. <laughs> just... But he didn't know Dan and S kid. This is too advanced for, mo- no, for normal I'm sorry. readers. <laughs> yeah. But he didn't know Dan and S kid had conflict between each other. Pat was walking ahead of them and he heard fighting. He said, what are you fighting? And parentheses, Diana and Escad were fighting. They said, ah. nothing. <laughs> what? <laughs> we got to the temple. That's the temple. That the temple is... looks a lot like Shredder's <laughs> helmet made out of wicker basket. <laughs> <laughs> what I really love is they're just like, 
just very stealthily and coyly fighting behind me, and I turn around like, "What are you doing?" They're like, "Oh, they put away their weapons." They're like, "No, no oh, the shit!" <laughs> they can't let me know that there's conflict within their group. Yeah, there's, it's it's like they know that my like, morale will just die. <laughs> it's like that. There's a there's a fucking um there's a I don't know if it's Outer Limits or, or Twilight Zone episode where there's like this character. And he like can just send people to this like this like other dimension that's just a co- endless cornfield, <laughs> and he would and he would just do that to anyone who did anything that he didn't like, and he was just this dumb kid. And it feels like you're that kid, yeah. With that, like, you just like banish them to this like fucking purgatory cornfield. <laughs> if they ever didn't do what you wanted. <laughs> So they're just stealthily fighting. Oh man, I can't wait till we get to the like first like fight. Oh man. Uh we found Matilda's room. Matilda also a character in that arc. Oh. Um basically it's like I don't even go into the part that Erwin and Matilda are like in love. Right. <laughs> Which is good. It's for the best. <laughs> Like, oh. Matilda's just kind of there and has nothing to do with anything. I really like the, the two paintings on the wall of the two characters. Yeah. They both look really fucking, like, done. <laughs> just, oh, God. They, they don't even know why. They're just like, are you taking the picture? All right. And then it's like, it's a big asparagus. <laughs> they're just like, yeah, what do we want in the room? Nothing but a portrait of me and my friend and then an asparagus the size of a person <laughs> hung from the ceiling. As is tradition. But yeah. the problem with what I was saying about, like, Matilda and stuff is that the, the like, love thing between Matilda and Erwin is huge to that arc, and it's, like, actually really good. <laughs> yeah. And in this, I'm like, nah, we don't need that shit. This is stupid. <laughs> Just, like, trying to catch That's that fucking asparagus icky. with a bear trap. Yeah, that, that, I'm, I'm 11, I don't give a shit about that shit. <laughs> um, we found out about the golden brooch. I forgot what plot significance that had in the game, but it's part of it. Uh, where to find it? We heard an earthquake. A tail came down, and it was huge. It was Irwin's tail. Oh my god! Oh, that's his tail! It's Irwin's tail. I thought tail. they were trying to catch the fucking thing in a bear trap. <laughs> no wonder they lost to him. He was huge. <laughs> he had a big ass. <laughs> All we got to see was his tail, but we could judge from that. He's <laughs> <laughs> just like a, a regular sized, like, fucking dude. Just with a <laughs> giant tail. Or just a gigantic ass with also a tail to make it a little bit more weird. <laughs> yeah. I, I just love how it's like, well, we, all we got to see was his tail. But, you know, we, kinda, we could kind of assume that the rest of him was huge because his tail he's, he's was. He's kind of got a T Rex style body, except for, like, the top half of him is, like, this is a normal man size. <laughs> yeah. Just hanging out, like, vestigially hanging out. Off gigantic T Rex legs. <laughs> he just has to, like, just a, guy like just a got, dude just shouting, just from, dude like, <laughs> shouting, and he's got like a t shirt and it's no pants because the pants would fit that. Yeah. And he just stomps around and you're just like, oh my god, a T Rex. Like, no, I'm Carl. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the spirit Aura was helping us. He blew an Aura Ray at Irwin. Dude, an Aura Ray. But he got away. He stopped the ray so he couldn't hit the city. He disappeared. And that one's that was just a cursive. <laughs> disappeared is important. Important! <laughs> he stopped the ray. So, like... Uh, I'm gonna show you what Irwin looked like. I hope it brings up the Billy and Mandy Irwin first. Uh, well, yeah. He has two forms. Well... This is... Not really. <laughs> not really. Disregard it's, that. It's pretty much the same. Um, this is what he looks like. He looks like this. He's got like a 10-pack. Yeah. And, uh... Hang on. Sorry. He's got crazy, like, goofy-ass legs. We'll get to that in a sec. He disappeared. Diana and Escad were fighting... They were scared. Catch that banana peel in the ghost trap. Scarred. (laughs) They were scarred. For life or just... (laughs) Probably just physically. Yeah, I mean, mean, when you get really... Like, when you see a ghost, you get scarred. Mm. Get real scarred. Uh, They were scared. Pat was thinking he thought, no wonder they lose. They hate each other. Pat broke the fight up. They knew they needed more power. Aura appeared and gave Pat a new armor and sword. (laughs) 
do okay and so they went to the lightning garden where the br- the Whoa. lightning garden I don't even remember the lightning that garden that sounds awesome though I mean like what do they like grow like just grow lightning and electricity wouldn't that just be a fucking power plant I don't think the lightning garden's part of anything cause like cause like what is is that like I don't remember is that, would that imply like like, it's like that's like something like a primitive person would say would call a fucking like power plant like it's a li- it's a lightning garden like it makes sense I mean like think about it yeah it's like just describe <laughs> it differently yeah it's interesting uh, Pat stopped to sharpen his sword then something hit him he turned around it was a big rock shot spontaneously oh shit and it sort of hurt him oh Okay. <laughs> he found his new armor is better. They decided to go in. Uh, Down just... here, it's like a cannon fires at me. I'm like, ah, that, that sort of hurts. <laughs> <laughs> and, that, and this looks like it's just a little garden spot in someone's lawn, and there's just lightning jumping between them. <laughs> That's like simultaneously the dumbest and the most awesome thing I've seen. <laughs> is like, just like... Fucking, there's not, like, corn and dumb shit. It's also, just fucking lightning bolts look in this at big field. Pat's armor here. It's got those little weird feet thing that I was so famous for. Oh, yeah. Little, and little. that's the sword. Look at how curly and curvy mm. it is. It's really cool. Mm. It's mm. very it's very mm. Kingdom Hearts. Mm. And that it looks weird and like a Lego piece. Yeah. No, they came into the garden. His shield blocked lightning. Dude. His shield blocked the lightning from the lightning garden. But he got hit by an arrow. There's also a met tool over there, I guess. <laughs> Careful. <Yeah. laughs> he got hit by an arrow. It hurt him. That proved he could still get hurt. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Sometimes I shoot hey, myself hey, with hey, arrows just to prove I still feel. Hold on. Let me show you how tough I am. Ouch. 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 Sail with an arrow. Just to see if I still free. <laughs> uh, does, does that does, does getting shot with things still hurt? Because that other thing, the cannon hitting me, did nothing, but an arrow totally did something for some fucking reason. Diana and Escad were still in quote shock. <laughs> yeah, just in shock. They were it's like what's... I'm being. It's like I'm being a fucking like asshole and they got like post traumatic stress disorder or something yeah, yeah, yeah. oh some, they're in shock from seeing you get shot with something <laughs> they like, saw the box the brooch was in this is that box that's a that's not ra- very box like no it's supposed to be a chest but it's oh yeah this looks like a metal helmet yeah <laughs> and all these little flowers are shooting lightning and shit that's pretty cool that's what makes it a lightning garden Got it. They oh, found the <laughs> Krang. Uh, no, hang on. See that? Yeah. That is this. Yeah, wow, you I totally, see it. You nailed it. Or no, uh, it's too small. But like Erwin in his demon form looks like a motherfucker. Like I can't find it. Here. You just type in Erwin's demon form. Yeah. Demon foam. I probably have to. But, like... It's... No, not that. No! (laughs) Oh, God, no! (laughs) (laughs) See, like, shit, I just gave myself super vibe. Maybe I ought to, like, look at where something is going before I click on it. He looks like that. Ah, dude. And And not that. No, uh, (laughs) Well, I think you nailed it, though. You really got, like, the But you polygons. capture his essence. Yeah. Yeah. Essentially, else. he is a face and hands. <laughs> they found the brooch. <laughs> <laughs> when Esked touched the brooch, he caught on fire. What? Why? Erwin saw he had the brooch. He was furious. Ah, you jerks! I'm gonna get real close to you! Uh, Pat tried. He got sick. Diana fine, and she tried, and she was fine. So, like, you just get random stand at status thing. Yeah, you, like, you touch, touch it, it, and just something bad happens to you. So, 
She was still in shock, though. Shit. Uh, she used the brooch to make Lucemia Irwin's home. That's like the most awesome level in the game. Right. It's called Lucemia, and it's this giant, like, like rock snake it flying in the sky, and it's oh, that's pretty amazing. Cool. But, it, but you know, it's in this, so it's way less awesome. Well, I mean, it looks kind of like a poop I took once. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, Eska... Yeah, I remember that poop. It's uh, it's, a spinning image. Yeah. It was perfect segments. (laughs) Coiled. Eska had dipped his head in the... (laughs) In the carp bucket. Carp bell with a K, by the way. The carp bucket. What? (laughs) You know, you know, you know what you were talking about. I I think, I think... There was a carp bucket. A bucket (laughs) full of carp. (laughs) What? What? And Escad was like, I gotta put my head in that shit. Or maybe you meant to say barrel, but you didn't know how to spell it. <laughs> oh, dude. But, but yeah. like, there, there's just establishing that there was just a carp bucket in Irwin's, yeah. like, house. He says a bucket full of carps. Uh, Dana Escad decided to go to Lysimia. It's windy there, and there are demons. <laughs> I like, I like... I like that. Like describing, it's like Chicago, the windy city. There also, are there are demons. <laughs> God damn! Um, there, Irwin was there. He wanted more power, so he called Shade. Gave Irwin something better. <laughs> he gave him something better. Here's something better. Because the other thing so like. She- Dan and Eska need oh, help. Geez. Pat came running. He said, I broke the brooch. Whoa. I can help. Now that I'm not sick. This is what Erwin looks like now. Oh, uh, no. Not this. This. I see it. <laughs> it looks like one of the Foster's Home for Imaginary no, Friends. <laughs> like, it looks yeah. like Wilt. <laughs> hey guys, want to play some basketball? Dana you said, you broke the brooch? We only have a minute until the place falls. They kept fighting. This is it. This is the oh, moment. Shit. This is what I am so happy My. that we're doing this for. Oh, shit. How Pat won. Activity. Commands. Required items. Sword. Shield. And a timer. Set for one minute. Uh, Here are the commands. <laughs> Up is jump. Um... Up and attack, and a sword is jump attack. <laughs> duck, uh, duck attack. Wait. Sword is just attack. Back forward, uh, then forward attack like a dash thing. Uh, block, then down into that fall attack. Uh, get up, uh, jump up, and like attack down. I guess so. Like um, end and start. So you have basically what this is is you LARP how the battle went. <laughs> <laughs> oh, in like real life? In, yeah, in real life, you, you LARP on it. <laughs> so, what you want to do, grab your little sword and grab your little shield, and everybody, I want you to get up and do this with me. Grab, <laughs> block and attack, attack, jump, fall and attack, duck, f- rising attack, a block, uh, forward and attack, jump, down and attack, back, like, back dash, down, up attack, block, attack, down, up attack, <laughs> back dash, forward attack, a block, down, like, uh, rising attack, block, attack, jump, down attack, down, jump attack, block, and sword, and then that. That's how a knight defeats a demon. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I f- like, all you need to do is take Woo! that chart and those words and put them on a shirt. <laughs> and just, that's how a knight beats a demon. <laughs> how pet. This needs to be a t shirt. Like, if we ever do t shirts, this has to be one. Because, <laughs> like, what in the actual fuck <laughs> is this? Like, it's like someone <laughs> barf. Like, they're fucking, like, they're cheat, like, they're fucking, like, like, they're bot, they're tool-assisted, like, speedrun of fucking Street Fighter into a fucking, like, book form. It's almost like, it's almost like, like, you're, you made Wii controls for a book. It's <laughs> just about exactly what it is. <laughs> yeah! This is incredible, isn't it? This is why I was so excited to tell you. Like, like you did this. Does anybody else want to LARP this with me? (laughs) (laughs) 
Come on, guys. You know you want to do this. Anyone would want to do something I'll like just... this when they're reading a book. Yeah, well, well I mean, <laughs> yeah. it'll keep me awake, I guess. <laughs> I mean, like, if I'm be starting to nod off, I could just start, like, just rip out my fucking Master Sword and shield and just start fucking just blocking fake in- invisible attacks from my book. 